It's finally showtime, and the red carpet greets us with all of the photo ops and media attention expected of the National Film Festival. After Christy and Nick do a quick interview, it's time for us to head inside and take our seats. Being surrounded by filmmakers, artists, and anti-cyberbullying leaders from around the country could be a little intimidating, but both Christy and Nick take it all in stride and enjoy the moment. Before the evening gets down to business, everyone is treated to a concert with musical performances from the San Francisco area hip-hop and R&B group, The League, the up-and-coming country singing sister duo of Jenny and Ashley, and the new boys, fresh off their European tour, were also on hand to pump everyone up for the awards. Watching everyone rush the stage, I couldn't help but think about this energy and atmosphere being a small glimpse of the type of positivity the No Goal Challenge is trying to create in schools across the country. And these students, these filmmakers, are part of that positivity. So I really believe in my heart that what you guys have done and all the people in this room that have supported these artists, these filmmakers, these incredible activists, is put power in the hands of the people. And now the one we've all been waiting for, the Best Noble Documentary of the Year Award. The Team Video Award goes to... The Formula, a high school thesis by Robert Hudson. So, although Dive didn't win, it did place in the top five out of over 260 films submitted. Though I have to admit, I was a little disappointed. I was hit with a moment of clarity as the winners wrapped up their acceptance speech and internationally renowned R&B artist Sean Kingston took the stage. This festival was less about the films and more about the purpose. Few people have the chance to make a real difference that can be seen in the world around them. But the people behind this festival and the filmmakers in it are making that difference. Their work and these films will hopefully spark a new generation of positivity and acceptance in our schools. Our trip and this show are made possible by our presenting sponsor, Remax Key Advantage of Effingham. They are outstanding agents giving you outstanding results. Visit them in Effingham at 601 West Fayette or online at EffinghamRealEstate.com. Additional sponsorship provided by Washington Savings Bank, where they are focused on making it convenient for you. By the First National Bank of Beaver. Serving the Central Illinois area since 1909. By Midland State Bank and their new Live line of checking accounts. And by People's Bank and Trust of Altamont. They put people first. <laughs>